alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh guys I'm here in the graveyard and I'm doing something that we should be all doing more regularly which is coming to the graveyards as the Prophet Muhammad told us to do um, and thinking about death because this is the reality death is the reality subhanallah we're all gonna end up in this place and we're all gonna end up dead and that's something we all need to focus on think about that is the true authenticity of the human being when they think about that which they're trying to forget about, frankly, you know, we all try and forget about the fact that we've got limited days on this earth and that we're going to end up under the ground. Subhanallah. And one thing that we're going to continue is going to continue is our deeds. Yeah, I mean, the only thing that's going to be benefit of benefit to us in, the, in that graveyard is our deeds. No material possession, just our deeds. And subhanallah, we're coming close to Ramadan. This might be our very last Ramadan. You know, and the Sahaba used to say, Allah, balighna Ramadan, bring us to Ramadan. Oh, Allah, bring us to Ramadan. And we have to start working hard from now because this is the very beginning. It's good to start strong. And we're going to do so, inshallah, by giving you an offer with Human Relief Foundation. You'll be working on the ground in many different countries, including Syria, where Ali Dawa is on the um, border of the Syrian border uh, in Lebanon. So he's in Lebanon. And he's dealing with as well as the whole team in HRF, they're dealing with, you know, the, the, those people in camps in that area. And we're delivering food packages to individuals there. 60 pounds will, will be enough for, to feed one family for the whole of Ramadan. So 60 pounds, subhanAllah, imagine how much reward you can get from 60 pounds. And for us here in the UK, for example, if you guys are watching this elsewhere, in Europe or the US or somewhere where there's a, so-called high economically developed status of that country then we should be really really like you know cognizant of the fact that we have a lot more money than those individuals we have so much more privileges than those individuals we have an obligation therefore to those individuals i feel like subhanallah we've forgotten about the syrian people i feel like subhanallah we've forgotten about the the people that have have, have been dejected have been rejected from their homes and driven out of their homes from this uh, for, 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 because of this war so subhanallah this is an opportunity guys let's start strong in ramadan let's do what we need to do because if we don't subhanallah we will regret it so hrf the link's going to be provided in the bottom of this video you know 60 pounds a whole family subhanallah it's going to be so great for us to do you know and allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the quran that if whatever you give for the sake of allah he'll bring it back to you and he's the best of providers so don't think you're going to be losing out by giving to charity. Allah will replace it for you. And you have to think about your grave and your space in that grave because those deeds that we do now are going to contribute to our reckoning in that grave. Assalamu alaikum wa